Good morning friends, it's Nicole from Relax Cut Glue and today I'm going to work on day four of ICAD 2020, index card a day. So I have seen in a lot of my uh, chats with friends, like a live video in the chats and stuff, a lot of people yesterday were saying they hadn't started yet, they were two days behind and you know, you can start whenever. And you can make up those days if you want and do three to catch up or just start whenever you feel like starting. Also, it is called index card a day, but you don't have to use an index card. I made my own out of card stock that are index card size. However, you can use any size you want. Whatever size that makes you happy, you use it. A five by seven, two and a half by three and a half. You can make ATCs. You know, whatever you have, you use. This is just supposed to be fun, and, you know, there's no there's no rules. So just have fun with it and start whenever. Better late than never, right? So just start. Okay, so today I, like I said, I'm going to work on June 4th, number 4 for the iCAD. And I already have what I'm going to do out. So this is just going to be a little craft along with me as I put this together. I hope everybody's having a great day today. It's Thursday, June 4th. I feel like even though it's only the fourth day of June, that time is starting to fly by. My son turns, my youngest son turns 13 in a few weeks, so I need to start planning for that. Just gonna put that down there. Can't believe my youngest is gonna be 13. I just, it's weird, you know, when your kids are younger, you feel like, oh my gosh, time goes by so slow. I mean, not that that's a bad thing, but you know, you have those days where they're toddlers and it's tough being a parent of a toddler. It's very rewarding because there's lots of firsts and it's exciting, but oh my goodness. They're a lot of work. And you think, oh, I can never imagine. They're never going to be 13. And then here you go. My youngest is going to be 13. Ugh. So weird. His last day of school is supposed to be next week, but I think they're just going to make next week some kind of fun thing and then today's really his last day so he's doing his live class right now or one of them for the day it's really gotten the hang of this online homeschool stuff we talked about doing it in the past he really wanted to do it but honestly I feel like he needs to be I don't know. He would do great. He's really good at managing his time and stuff, but I just worry about the social aspects of not uh, being around people because he's kind of like his mom and a total homebody, so that worries me. Okay, so I have this cute little puppy, and don't come for me, but I'm going to make him weird. I'm going to add this little lady head there, and then I'm going to put at some point somewhere I'll have to figure out how I want to do this one of a kind and wild as art so I need to figure out how I'm going to get all these on here I wonder if I could go like that Or maybe like that. How am I gonna do this? Okay, I think I'm gonna do that. I think I'm gonna put its paws like this. Okay, so first I wanna put down Wild as Art. Get this bad boy down. I'll just put wild as art kind of in the middle-ish area. Okay, so 
So now I think what I'm going to do first is glue the head to the dog. This cute, tiny little puppy is turning into a, a lady. Okay, let's see. Got her on there. And I'm just going to turn this over. And glue the whole thing and put her down. Okay. So I'm going to make it so the paw goes on here, but then this one sets like it's standing on it. Oh, maybe I need to go down just a little bit further. Just so her head, oops. Okay. Ah, got a wrinkle. This is a no wrinkle zone. Okay, so now I got her down. I was gonna, my plan was to kind of make this wonky. Didn't really plan on putting the dog over this far. I forgot about this part. Oh well, we'll make it work. Let's put this part down first. The little wonky part. Baby washcloth. Smooth it out. Kinda have a headache today. I wonder if it's the weather. Not sure, but I'm not really a fan. Okay, so I think what I'm gonna do is cut this. I'm gonna put one of this is cut one. of Okay, we'll do that. Yes, I hear you, Blanche. I'll be over there in just a minute. Give me a minute. I'll give you some treats. It's my little critter over to the right. Her name is Blanche from the Golden Girls. Her sisters, Rose, Dorothy, and Sophia have all passed on, so I just have her now, just a little Blanche. Okay, one of, now I need to put a kind. If I should have put one of a kind. No. Uh oh, this isn't working how I wanted it to. Oh, this is going to be moved. Perfect. Love it when a plan comes together. One of a kind. I wonder if this is still wet. No, it's not. Darn it. Should have moved that down just a little bit. Oops. Okay. Wild, one of a kind, and wild as art. I feel like it needs something. What do I have? I want like a little image. Oh gosh, that was almost a disaster. Oh, not good. I'm going to put over there. 
Hey, Missy Moo. You're making noise over there. What you doing? Oh, where's a butterfly? I just had one. And there's one right here. Maybe I'll put a little butterfly right here. Although, hmm. Wait, here's one. Oh, no, that's not the one I wanted. Okay, moving buckets. I thought I put a butterfly in here that I'm thinking of. Here, little butterfly. Come out and play. I know I did. I just don't know where it is. The cat head. Thought it was a butterfly. There's a bird. Hmm. Well, I guess it doesn't want to come out and play. like that butterfly, but let's look in my sticker book here. Here's some butterflies. Maybe I will use this one. However, I want to fussy cut it. Because I don't think, let's see, how will that look if it's just hanging out there? Eh. Oops. All right, a little fussy cutting. Well, I suppose I could have left some of the border. Too late now. There we go. Don't want to chop off its head, but I am chopping off its antenna. Sorry. We'll give you some new ones. Some upgraded ones. Oh, she's chomping away over there. I can hear it. <laughs> what is she eating? Okay, get all that off. This right. Here, and then we'll draw some new antenna for her. Let's see. Using my micron, I'm going to use 01 or 01. Oh shoot, I don't want them down here. Oh well, Pfft. I'm an idiot. Okay. And I think I'm gonna ink around the edges of this one because I feel like that'll bring it all together. butterfly back and I wonder if I should I was kind of thinking about outlining the micron out again let's see 
one, three, go use the three. Maybe just underline. Okay, punch a little hole in there. Okay, ah, well now I, oh geez. Oh well, you could still read it. So here we go, one of a kind and wild as art. Oh, there's a bubble right there. No. Get out. It's a chunk of glue. Oh, you. You messed with the wrong chick. Ugh. Now it looks like he has a little tumor. Get out. Definitely don't hang out over there. That looks like a... Oh, great. Now I took the color off. Okay, I have to stop. Or did I? Oh, I did. Ah! I need a brown marker. Where are my markers? No, that's definitely the wrong color. Oh, my gosh. There we go. Okay, I am going to put this card back in this thing before I ruin it any more than I already have. Okay, let's get her in there. And there we, oh, I forgot to put my stamp on it. Today is the fourth. Ta-da! Put a fork in it. It is done. Thanks for crafting along with me today, guys. I really appreciate it. I will catch you in the next video. Have an awesome day. Bye.